This nibble originally aired on RSPMB Update, episode 835, as an Audra did nothing wrong. Enjoy. When you bring back the Ice Ward, uh, Saren will appear. As an Audra and Saren have a discussion, and he does this with each of the gods that appear. And their discussion was quite interesting. It was about the ritual of rejuvenation, and he says that he's come to understand that Saren's uh, did this from her own point of view, and actually thanks her and he says that we may be few in number, but we are stronger now than ever and have, en- and have endured. Without your invent- intervention, we would not have. Regardless of your own feelings on the matter, I just wanted you to know that I no longer hold any grudge with you. I trust your intentions then and now. This is bringing up major red flags for me. Yeah, because it's a complete, it's a complete turn of character for what the Majorat felt with Saren. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, there might be that kernel of doubt in your head that says maybe Azanaj is actually telling the truth because of ascension and just everything that's currently going on. Mm-hmm. It, it sort of feels to me like the, so if any Majra would do this, it, it might just be Azzy because he's the sort of person who has rationalized Zaras' actions for years and years and yeah. years. And I guess he can do so to Zaras' sibling as well. Mm-hmm. Mm. But what's really raising major red flags to me is also Saren's reaction because at the time of Children Saren. of Month, he was so screamy and ah can't can't handle the consequences of her own actions. But now she's all unapologetic. I will not apologize for what I did to you, and. That's really making me think. Like, it feels Saren's almost like a parallel. What was that? Theron is the one who's making me worry the most. Yeah, it feels like a parallel. What, what as, it, as an address says, is it's worth all the destruction you caused in our race because we got to re- survive and we got to re- reproduce. And that's essentially the same thing that's on the table with the Elder Gods here. It's their survival and it's their reproduction. And since she's all, mm. none shall more fiercely protect these eggs from harm than I. You think she's a double agent? Well, what if we do end up having to destroy these eggs. Because at the moment, we're really just holding the threat yeah. off. and this just really sums up what I feel is going to happen at the end of this. Zaros is going to wind up dead somehow. Saren will shatter herself, and these gods will be depowered in some way. Yeah, because I'm not sure there is a way in which these elder gods get defeated and Saren also does not end up as a exactly. casualty of that somehow. Exactly. Yeah, you're 100% right in that. You can find full episodes of RSBNB Update right here on this YouTube channel. If you found this video useful or just enjoyed it, like and subscribe or leave a comment.